Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. In this video, I'm going to share how you can boot your computer faster and the performance of your computer way better than earlier. All these steps are tried and tested and very easy to follow. So let's get started. In the start icon, just do a right click and go to settings. Now here we need to go to apps on the left hand side. Now in apps, you will find an option called startup. And here, please make sure that you disable all unwanted applications. Turn it off. So like, I do not want Cortana, I do not want Microsoft Teams, and whatever. And things which is very important like graphics and audio and other Wi-Fi things should not be turned off. It should not be turned off. So once you are done, close this window and we will go to the power options for to enable faster boot. So for that, in the search icon, type control and you will find control panel. And if you do not see the window like this, then you just need to click on this view by and click on small icons. Now once you're here, look for power options. So I have found it. So I'll just click on that. And here you will find a window like this. And you just need to click on change plan settings and then here you will find your options. If you do not get that option, then at the left hand side you will find choose what power options, power buttons do. So I'll click on that and here you will find shutdown settings and here you will have faster boot. So check mark and then click on save changes. Once this is done, I'll close this window and we need to click on start icon again and go to task manager. Now here in the task manager, again, we will go to startup just to ensure which all applications are running at the startup. So I can see the graphics, Intel graphics is running, which is absolutely fine. It should not be disabled. Windows security should be turned on and other important things which you think should be there at the startup is fine and applications which you do not want, just do a right click and click on disable. Once this is done, close this window. The reason of your slow computer could be cache as well, the junk as well. It will also make the computer slow as well as the boot. So for that, just press window and R key together and type clean MGR. I'll just maximize it. Clean MGR. And once you have typed it, click on OK. And a window will appear like this. Make sure you check mark all the things here and just hit OK. You're going to delete all the junks, all the temporary internet files and cache from your computer. Once this is, once you have selected, just click on OK and you will be get rid of maybe 10, 20 gigabytes of junk sitting on your computer and making the computer slow. And it, this will definitely boost up the PC. Once this is done, at the right hand side, just click on this up arrow key just to look for the Windows Defender. So I'll just do a double click. I'll just try to open it and it will open up like this. And here we need to go to virus and threat protection. I'll click on that and we will do a quick scan. So this will remove all kinds of bugs if you have in your computer that will be scanned and it will be removed from the PC. So once you do that, it might take some time, but it will definitely increase the performance. And you can leave this as it is. And while doing this, I'll just minimize this. And here in the start icon, type CMT and then run as an administrator. Now, once you do that, it will ask you to say yes. And a window will appear like this. Now here you need to type SFC space forward slash scan now. Now it will repair, it will scan your whole computer and if your windows has some corruption, it will repair those windows files. So it's a very good thing to do. So once you have typed SFC space forward slash scan now, hit enter and it will begin the process and it may take 10-15 minutes. Once this is done, just restart the computer and then we will move to the next step. Now once the computer is booted, Click on the search icon again, type CMD and run as an administrator. 
and I'll click on yes and here we need to type one more command and I'll mention this on the description as well so we just need to type we just need to copy and here you just paste it like this DISM space online space cleanup hyphen image space forward slash restore health so this will this is a very effective step it will also repair the Windows files so any which way it will do good for your computer so I'll just hit enter and it will start repairing it it will start scanning the whole computer and it will repair if anything is corrupted in the computer it's a very good practice to do and it may take 10-15 minutes once this is done just restart the computer and see the performance of your computer now we will go to the browser because most of us also use browser so we also need to increase the browser performance so we will be increasing the performance of Google Chrome and Microsoft Edge so I'll open Google Chrome let me just close this so I'll open Google Chrome first and here at the stop at the top right corner click on the three dots and then go to settings and here we need to click on extensions now please make sure you do not have any unknown unwanted extension if you see any extension which is not known to you and you don't use it just click on remove this will actually boost up the performance of your browser so the browser experience will be better than earlier once this is done click on the three dots again and then go to settings now here we will click on advanced at the left hand side and here you will find reset at, and here you will find reset and clean up now restore settings to their original defaults once I'll click on that it is it is mentioned bookmarks history and saved password won't be affected so which is good so once you click on reset settings the whole browser will be reset and if you have any slow performance issues in the browser that will be fixed now we will increase the performance of Microsoft Edge so for that just do a double click on the Microsoft Edge now once you click on this three dots look for extensions now same I don't have any extensions in the browser but in your case if you find any unwanted unknown uh, extensions just remove it and once this is done click on the three dots again and click on the settings icon and once you do that at the left hand side you will find one option which called reset settings so once I'll click on that you will find restore settings to their default values now this will reset your startup page new page search engine and pen tabs it will also turn off all extensions and clear temporary data like cookies your favorites history and safe passwords will not be cleared so once you read it just click on reset and it will reset the whole browser and then restart the computer and see the performance there is one more thing which most of us forget to do and that is very important for that you just need to click on the search icon and type update now you will find Windows update settings so I can see the last check was today and I'm absolutely up to date with all Microsoft updates you just need to click on check for updates and please make sure that you install all latest Microsoft updates in your computer so once this is done restart the computer and let me know in the comment section how is the performance of your computer and please hit the like and subscribe I'll see you in the next video. Have a wonderful day.